So we're just having breakfast. Gatsby's eating a little treat, and I'm having oats in a jar. Um, this was the mostly empty peanut butter jar that I used to make my cookies. There was just like a little bit at the bottom. So I put my oatmeal that I'd already made on Monday in here and topped it off with some frozen raspberries. So Gatsby and I are now driving. Do you like my shirt? There are little Gatsby's, Gatsby's face all over it. <laughs> Um, we are driving to the dealership, which, mind you, is about 35, 40 minutes away from where I live. And we're, you know, we go to that one because my friend's husband works there. And I, like, totally screwed it up my suspension or my steering. I don't know. Like, my car is going crazy. So he's with me. And I called my mom. Well, my mom called me. We were just, like, having a regular conversation. And, like, she's like, what are you doing? And I'm like, I'm about to get ready. I have to go up to Rockland County to drop my car off. Like, do you want to come for a ride with me or follow me? Because, like, my car is not, like, I really should not be driving it. Like, on a highway. Like, what I'm doing now is fine. Which is fine because I went all the way to Connecticut yesterday with it. And if I just drive, like, under the speed limit and, like, don't go over, like, 50 miles an hour, it's okay. So, I told her, I was like, you know, I really need you to, like, follow me. Like, God forbid something happens to my car. Like, just, you know, like, make sure I get up there safe. And she's like, yeah, 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 of course. So, and there's, like, an outdoor mall up there. So, we're waiting for my car to get fixed. We can, like, go shopping. And she calls me, like, 45 minutes later because I'm getting ready. And she's like, where are you? Like, your father and I are starving. And I'm like, wait, dad's coming? Like, not that that's a bad thing. I love my dad. But, like, you didn't tell me that. And anytime my dad comes anywhere, he just wants to, like, go out to eat and sit in his car and smoke a cigar. So, like, I'm like, wait, dad's coming? And also, like, I still my breakouts on my chin are pretty bad I mean they're healing a little bit but I just put some spot treatment on them and I really didn't want to put any makeup on this morning because I just don't want to like clog the pores more or irritate them more so all I put on my skin right now like the only thing that's on it is the ambient lighting powder of the like palette I put the lighter part like under my eyes and like the two darker ones just like underneath my cheekbones and around my forehead and I actually really like the way it looks. Like, it doesn't look like I'm wearing makeup. It just looks like my skin, and it's not heavy. Like, I mean, it's just like a very light, like, dusting finishing powder. So, yeah. I, I haven't worn I've worn it, but over, like, concealer and foundation, I've never worn it by itself. This is the first time. It's the only thing on my face, and I am a fan. Gatsby, are you ready to go inside? Ready to go inside? Where are you going? Gatsby and I just got home. He is so pooped because we were at the mall walking around shopping all day. So we went to drop off my car and it's up in like Nanuet, Rockland County, whatever, which is like 30 minutes away from where we live. And I went to my parents' house and met both of them. Every time I have to get my car dropped off, they always come with me. So there's a big outdoor mall there. It's really nice. So Gatsby's been walking around in the cold all day and he's so pooped. You're so tired. He's so warm because he had that sweater on. Um, so yeah, he's napping now. My parents left. It's like four o'clock. And so we did a little bit of shopping. I'll show you that in a second. I'm just getting ready to like light some candles. I got a couple of Christmas cards today. This is the Better Homes and Gardens vanilla cookie crunch wax melt. I'm going to put that in my warmer because I'm going to be lighting the Bath and Body Works um, Italy Destinations candle and it just it smells like lemon starburst. It's like super like candy juicy lemony and I really hoped it had some kind of bakery note so I want to um, melt it uh, burn it with just one of these wax melts like just a little bit to give it like that little hint that little subtle bakery note and then I am lighting this is Yankee Candles Berry Trifle, and if you can see in there, it's had a little bit of a tunneling issue. I had this on this morning. I will say, though, that the throw is pretty good on this one. I've heard some bad reviews, a lot of people saying that 
It really doesn't throw. You can't smell it. I can definitely smell it. It's like a sweet, creamy berry type of scent. It almost reminds me of like Bubblicious Bubblegum in a way, but it's really good. So that's going in my kitchen. In my bathroom here, I'm going to continue on with this um, 719 Walnut Ave Peppermint Twist. Now, I had this going this morning. It's actually like resolved itself as far as the tunneling issues go. I mean, not completely, but at least a little bit. It's doing a little bit better. Um, I'm just trying to, I really don't want to touch it. Like, it was a $4 candle. It's just like the Walmart candle, and I don't want to waste my time. Like, I don't want to be sitting here putzing around with this candle, like wasting my time cotton balling it, foiling it, whatever, whatever. Like, I just want to see what it does on its own. So I'm just kind of letting this go and not bothering with it and seeing what happens. So earlier today, this wick over here extinguished itself. They're just so puny, they can't even like hold their form. If you haven't noticed yet, my bedroom is sort of the place where I put candles that I'm kind of over that I just want to burn down and get rid of. And this one is Goose Creek's Campfire Marshmallow. And it's in the Chewick Tumbler and it burns okay. It's been sooting a little bit. It's just unscented. Over here in my front entryway, I have Yankee Candles Sugared Apple going again. Oh my goodness, I love this candle so much. It is such a great scent. It is so crazy strong. I am shocked at how awesome this candle is. On my coffee table, I just have a little, um, I think it's like a Chesapeake Bay tea light going just for Marshalls. I have my vanilla cookie crunch melting away. In the centerpiece, I have my Luminara going. And over here, by my Christmas tree. Oh, it makes me so happy to see. <laughs> and Gatsby's stocking over here. I don't know if I showed you guys this before. Gatsby's stocking is the only one that's filled. He has more stuff in his stocking than Dan and I both have in ours. There it is. Stop moving. We actually got this on Etsy. If you just search like, I think we searched pet burlap stockings. How you doing over there? Sleepyhead. So, over by my sparkly tree. This is where I have the, oh, did you see my little Santa pig on skis? He's so cute. I have the Italy Tuscan lemon tart, whatever it is, I think, going. I can't really smell it yet, but it just lit. I'm just going to do some laundry. I need to brush my hair so bad. Um, I'm just going to put the laundry in. I think I'm going to bake a few more Christmas cookies. I have some like M&M cookies to bake. I don't know if I want to do like cookie dough balls or like actually make them the legitimate cookies. Um, I'm going to do those and what else am I going to do? I have to do the laundry. I think I said that. And that's like it. I'm going to make breakfast to take to work tomorrow and pack my bag. Do all that. I haven't eaten since breakfast and it's four o'clock, but I'm not really hungry. I had a Starbucks at the mall with my mom. I had a um, skinny peppermint mocha iced. It was really good, but like it was really filling. So yeah, I don't know. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Do you see this little guy back here? Oh, hello. <laughs> do it. Okay, I'm hoping that you can see this mountain of laundry better in the mirror. Like, <laughs> There is so much to do. I love my little, um, the banner that I have going here. So cute. So let me show you what I got at our little shopping, my little shopping trip with my parents. Um, so first, um, I only purchased from three stores. It was a little bit of a smaller mall, so there weren't too many stores there. Um, but there was a paper source. I love this store. And I got a couple of cards. So first I got this one. Oh, hello for my friend from work because we call each other potato and I have never seen a card with freaking potatoes on it even though it says friend chips but still um potato chips <laughs> I was just dying so I was like oh my god two potatoes it's so perfect for her and then this I got for my husband Merry Woofing Christmas obviously I got it because Gatsby is on it <laughs> so those are two Christmas cards done. And then um, my mom and I went into Lush. This is one of my mom's favorite stores. So I picked up a Christmas gift for her when she wasn't looking. Um, cause she was looking at this. It was at the counter. And I was like to the guy, I'm like, can you really discreetly like wrap this up for her? So it is the little bath bomb and the glitter angel. It smells 
Mm, just like very sweet and fresh. So it's got glitter on the back and then it's just white on the front. And my mom loves angels and she loves glitter. So this is so up her alley. So I had to get that for her. Um, put that over there. I'm going to wrap that up now. And then for myself, I just picked up two more toners because I just needed these. I was out. This is my nighttime toner, the Aroma Water. And this is just like a moisturizing, great toner for before you go to sleep at night. Because it just keeps your skin like soft and moisturized. And rose water is just amazing for your skin. And then I got this tea tree water. Um, this is what I spritz on my face before and after I work out and when I'm walking around the city. It just like keeps your uh, pores closed, keeps the oil out, and is great for like to prevent breakouts while you're exercising or like in a filthy environment like New York City. And then of course we went to Bath and Body Works and I had a coupon for a free travel size item. So I got another velvet sugar. Every free item I've gotten, they've all been velvet sugar because they're discontinuing the scent. So I am stocking up because velvet sugar smells so amazing. And then I did get two candles because my mom purchased a candle for um, a gift exchange and I had a 10 off of 30. So I was like, wait, we have to get three candles and use the coupon. And she didn't want another one. So I was like, I will gladly get two. You know, I can find two. I got another 10 off of 30, 20 off of 50, which is awesome. Save that for the semi-annual and another snowman. So the two candles that I got. I got the winter candle in this adorable jar. I love these jars. Um, the only two scents that I like from these are winter and then um, I do like sparkling icicles and then the balsam, but I wasn't crazy about this glass and the green for the balsam. I just really like the clear. So I was like, whatever, I'll get the winter because I do love this fragrance. And these glasses are super pretty. And then I got another destination. I got two yesterday, but I needed more. I could not decide on this one or the Caribbean. Um, but then I ended up getting this one because I think the Caribbean, like that, I like the pineapple scent, but it was just so fruity. And sometimes those fruity ones smell like pee or like body odor to me. And I really just, what I liked about the Caribbean the most was the label. So I held off on it. I do really want the Honolulu Sun because I love that fragrance, but I'm not going to burn that in the winter. So, and it had like the Christmas lights all over the palm tree. So I like the label is too wintry to burn in the summer. It's a summer scent, but I wouldn't want burn that label in the summer. And then it's a winter label, but I don't want to burn it in the winter. So I'm just like, whatever. And even though I have so many London tea and lemons, I just love this scent. It's a year round fragrance for me. And now I can save the other ones I have for the spring and summer. And I can use this one in the winter. And this isn't even like Christmas. This is just snow. It's such a pretty label. And I love this scent so much. 